It's Three Minute Thursday. Hey, welcome back to another Three Minute Thursday. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Gary, if you don't know. I'm a cybersecurity professional with a military intelligence background. And in this week's Three Minute Thursday, we're going to look at AI in the context of OSINT. Get three minutes on that clock and let's roll. So first things first, OSINT AI tools. Let's have a look. Here's an article. Here's an article from the University of Oxford. There's no juicy, obvious tools that jump out at me. Just having a look down here really to see if there's any links to any tools. No. University of Oxford. Doesn't really look like there's going to be anything juicy here. It's really all just articles about the art of the possible. I did, however, come across in my search this tool, Silect.io. I don't know what that means. The website doesn't fill me with confidence right off the bat, not to judge a book by its cover, but you know what I mean. Let's see if this works. Our tool helps you find the data needle in the internet haystack. You know, finding needles in haystacks is easy. You get a metal detector. Finding a needle in a stack of needles, much, much harder. I'd like to know as much as possible about Gary Ruddle. They say you should never Google yourself. He has a YouTube channel, which is at Gary Ruddle Official. Let's see what it does. Okay, so it redirects us over to Perplexity AI. Never heard of that before. Gary is a YouTuber with a channel focused on cybersecurity, OSINT, and creator skills. True. It has over 11,400 subscribers. True. And features videos and topics covering cyber problems, MITRE attack, showdown, Google dorking. Also true. He has a significant following on LinkedIn with over 30,000 connections. So I think it's pulling that from one of the descriptions on my YouTube channel. I think it says like 30K plus on LinkedIn. So it's doing some natural language processing there. His website is GaryRuddle.com. The channel also features content related to Lego sets and creator skills. 10K celebration video. I got a YouTube Lego brick. There it is. Okay, so it's pretty good. Let's scroll down. Um, what's his background? Okay, he has experience in the intelligence community. CTI professional, holds the OSCP, CompTIA Security Plus. So I can see here it's got my LinkedIn profile. If I just open that up, it does indeed load my LinkedIn profile. It's also found me being on the Authenticate Needle Stack podcast. Lovely chaps, by the way. Let's see more. Has Gary published any books? Yes, Gary's published a book called Cyber Threat Intelligence 101. The book is aimed at the, yeah, so it's doing a great job here. It's scraping that off of my LinkedIn page. Where can I purchase the book? Okay, that that's not a plug at all. That's genuinely really good, actually. When I came here earlier to test this, I got mixed results. It started getting me confused with Gary Rudell in America, who is an artist who looks like this. And obviously that's not me but it's doing much better this time. I don't know if it's learned something about me and now that I'm back here again, it's much more focused. So that's kind of it. I couldn't really find many more AI powered tools that are just readily available, a bit like a Google search or like ChatGPT that just help solve OSINT type problems like this. I'll leave links below if you wanna try it out yourself. And if you do know of any AI tools that are gonna help the community, I'd love it if you left a comment below with a link to what that tool is. I'll see you next week.